Hey, I'm Helene, and today I'm going to be talking about the books I'm taking with me on vacation. And I don't know why I'm doing this video, it's just random that I felt the need to do a video, so I'm doing it. Anyway, I'm going on vacation, like tomorrow, which is when this video will probably go up. So probably today, for you. And I'm bringing books with me, even though I will probably be really busy, but you know, I have to bring books. I can't just like not bring books, that would be stupid. Anyway, I'm going on a road trip. To Seattle which should be fun. I've been there a billion times so it's nothing new but it's still fun. I like Seattle. I really like Seattle. It's gonna be awesome. Anyway I've decided to bring with me three books which I can't believe I'm doing this. I Watch me not read at all the entire trip. I bet it's gonna happen. Anyway I'm bringing them with me even though they'll probably take up a lot of room but you know I don't even care. The first book I'm bringing with me is Steelheart by Brandon Sanderson because I got this from the library kind of a while ago and I'm I'm almost done and I just need to finish it because it's due it's due tomorrow okay well it's not going back tomorrow it's gonna be late but I need to finish this and I'm really liking it I'm liking it so much more than I thought I would and it's awesome like I love the action and the main character who's really funny. I love his internal dialogue and everything. And it's such a cool sci-fi fantasy thing. And yeah, it's awesome. The next book I'm bringing with me is The Murder Complex by Lindsay Cummings. And I started this book beginning of July. And I'm reading this because Ryan O'Neill is doing a read-along of this book until July 24th when there is going to be a live show. So I gotta read this. And I am, I was, yeah, I'm right here. And I'm, well, almost done. Kind of. And this book's amazing. Oh my gosh. I'm loving this book so much. It is crazy. It is crazy. And it's like a really quick read. Like, you know how some writing is just like makes you read it faster? This book is definitely like that. And I love books like this. And the chapters are so short. I love short chapters. I love them to death. So you should read this if you haven't already. It's awesome. This will probably be my like priority read because I am doing it for a read along and I have to do the live show with Ryan on the 24th. So I have to like finish it. And I'm enjoying it the most of all the books I'm reading right now. So yeah. The next book I'm bringing, and I can't believe I'm bringing this because I'm already reading five books right now, like at the same time. And I'm like, oh, why don't I just add another one to the list? Like, yeah, that's a good idea, Pauline. No, but I'm doing it anyway. I'm reading We Were Liars by E. Lockhart because I just really, really want to read this. And I feel like it's so short. It's such a quick read. I could probably read it on the car ride over when I'm not driving. <laughs> um, so, and if I don't get car sick, that would suck. But it just, I just really want to read this. I just, I just need to read it because I want to talk to people about this. And I can't unless I've read it. So this is, yeah. I was going to bring the, what is this called, The Summer Under Pretty Trilogy by Jenny Han because this is one of the books that I'm currently reading and look at, I have made like no progress even though this book is really good so far. I'm just like reading the other books. But I was going to bring this because I want to read it but it's so big because it's all three of them and it, it just takes up such a big chunk of space. And I put my books in my laptop bag whenever I travel. And this, this will not fit with the others. It just won't. So unfortunately, this is staying behind. Even though I kind of want to bring it. But it's so big. I just, I can't do that. So yeah, these are the books I'm bringing with me on vacation. And hopefully I actually get some reading done. I'm going to be really busy. But I'm thinking I'll probably be reading like in the car. Because it's like a six hour drive, which I will be driving half of, but then there's like three hours for me to do nothing, and I'll probably read. And then like at night before I go to bed, because I always have to read before I go to bed. So hopefully I will actually make progress. I can't believe I'm reading three books, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Such a stupid idea. But whatever, that's what I'm doing. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you've read any of these books or you are currently reading any of these books, leave a comment below. Tell me what you thought about them, what you're thinking about them, because I love hearing people's thoughts on books. It's the whole point of booktube. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.